Well, I think it's like often uh, the things that make us feel uncomfortable about ourselves are a good start writing or starting point for a writing process. And so we, in talking with our writers and, and engaging in this conversation about social media and like how you use it as a public tool in public discourse, we all started, we all had really weird feelings about it and it was uncomfortable. And so we were like, we should dig into this and see if there's something here. Yeah, so. I agree. I feel like a lot of good things to write about are things you kind of know you're hypocritical about. Yeah. So everyone's hypocritical because like the system is set up for you to have like, disparate feelings about things. It's just confusing. And then if you're not all one thing, people are like, you're a hypocrite. So those are the things that are really rich for writing, because those are things a lot of people feel. So the episode is about an unnamed tragedy, and then the social media competition to see who grieves the most. And it's weird, because when a horrible thing happens, a school shooting, or Trump being elected, or uh, but not political, Go Trump. You know what I mean? If that's your thing. No, don't, um, no. But if that's not your thing, don't go Trump. Don't if that's go not Trump. your thing, don't go Trump. No, oh, never go anyway, Trump. the point is, oh, you don't like him? No, oh, I, I thought you liked him. I don't him. mean to be radical, but I don't, you don't like, like Donald him. Trump. Yeah. Oh, he's so liberal, though. Uh, but anyway, uh, the point is, when there's a horrible thing that happens, there's like this... <laughs> but he's so liberal, He's so though. liberal. He would be if that's what would get him elected, right? Yes. Anyway, the point is, if there's a horrible thing that happens... You, you like rush to the computer to be like, it's so horrible, you know, thoughts and prayers, because you feel like you need to talk about it, but then you're like, who am I talking to? Like, the, none of the survivors or victims are reading this, so then you feel bad for doing that, but if you don't do something, you're like, I'm being silent in the face of a nightmare. So it's this perfectly hypocritical situation, or it's ripe for hypocrisy, and you don't really know what to do, and I feel like so much of being alive right now is not knowing what to do or how to act ethically and also effectively. And that's just rich for writing about it. And I feel like if your targets are the right thing, and essentially our targets are us <laughs> and yeah. our actions, you're, you're getting closer to nailing it than not already. Mm -hmm.